So this first video is going to be my PS1 collection. As you can see, another collection video. This is my Dreamcast collection. Are my entire PS2 games collection. Alright, back again with another collection video. It's Wii time. Yeah, I think it's about time for another collection video. Let's go! Alright, guys, so what you see here is my N64 collection. Uh, it's pretty small, it's not too big. Uh, consists of 21 loose cartridges and two complete inbox games, which I'll show you in just a sec. Alrighty, so first game we have 1080 Snowboarding. Haven't played it. <laughs> uh, I have the GameCube version, but I never gave this one a go. Perhaps one day in the future. Alright, next. Back when Rare was in its prime, before uh, before Microsoft bought it off and screwed everything up, this is uh, Banjo Kazooie, one of the best platformers on the Nintendo 64. If you do not have this for your N64, you are missing out. Same goes for the sequel, Banjo Tooie. Basically, perfected everything from the first one. Although I do have more fond memories with the first one, but still, great game. Oh, sorry about that. Next two games, Cruisin' USA and Cruisin' World. Very arcadey racing games. Uh, played a lot of Cruisin' USA as a kid. From what I can remember, was really fun. Cruisin' World, not as much. I didn't play this game as much, but still, both very good racing games on the N64. Rare's answer to Mario Kart featuring Diddy Kong along with his friends uh, I believe uh, Banjo is in there and Conker is in there as well so they pretty much uh, did like a Mario Kart-esque game with a little added uh, kind of like an adventure element to it pretty cool now this game I played briefly as a kid Glover uh, basically you play as this little glove guy and you're pushing this ball around a, uh, a level and avoiding obstacles and things and uh, trying to reach a goal. That's pretty much what I remember from this game. I've only played it briefly as a kid. Alright, here we go. GoldenEye 007. This was the Call of Duty before Call of Duties. This pretty much defined first-person shooters back in the N64 days. I remember playing countless hours multiplayer with my friend, my best friend at the time. Uh, I had to be like maybe 11, maybe younger than that. <laughs> but yeah, very fun game. If you, uh, again, if you do not have this for the N64, you must get it. Jet Force Gemini, another rare game. I have not played this game yet, but from what I can see through uh, reviews and stuff, it's a pretty good game, pretty solid game. Alright, The Legend of Zelda, Ocarina of Time. Now this cartridge and the label are brand new. The label's a reproduction label. Uh, when I first got it, it was beat to hell. Like, the, the label was all messed up, the cartridge itself was all jacked up. So I got a replacement cartridge and a uh, reproduction label and pretty much restored it instead of paying, like, $30 for a brand new game. So yeah, um, I'm about, I want to say a quarter of the way through it. Uh, not this one, but the 3DS version of it, which is the definitive version. But yeah. Solid Zelda game. Love it. Alright, here's where the story gets a little sad. Uh, this game was given to me by a dear friend of mine who recently passed away last month uh, from uh, lung cancer. Well, he actually had cancer in several other parts. Uh, it, it actually spread throughout his body. But unfortunately, he lost the battle. Uh, a few months ago, he actually gave me this. He had a spare, so I said, I'll take it. Haven't played it yet, but uh, it's Mario Tennis. You can't go wrong with Mario Tennis. 
Pilot Wings 64. I remember playing countless hours of this game, mainly because I liked the way the characters screamed every time you crashed into things. It was pretty hilarious at the time. Uh, I don't know how it holds up today. I haven't I haven't popped it in the N64 since I was a kid, so I have no idea how it holds up to today. But yeah, Pilot Wings 64, another fun game. Pokemon Snap. Why hasn't there been another Pokemon Snap? This was awesome. Pretty much a first person shooter, but instead you're using a camera and you're shooting Pokemon. Enough said. Get this game for the N64. You have to get this game. Rugrats Scavenger Hunt. Did I say that right? Rugrats Scavenger Hunt. <laughs> but yeah, I used to play this a whole lot with my brother back when we were kids uh, it's literally a bunch of board games and you play with the Rugrats characters also one of my favorite uh, cartoons as a kid awesome game all right these two are pretty scarce on the n64 you like you can't really get these for a good deal anymore uh, also given to me by my dearly departed friend uh, Snowboard Kids 1 and 2. I haven't played them yet, but I do plan on playing them in the future. Heard they're really good. Alright, Star Fox 64. The last proper Star Fox ever. <laughs> Nintendo, come on. Bring back this game. Well, not this game, but a new version of this game. Come on. Star Wars Rogue Squadron. Uh, I haven't played it yet, but it's Star Wars, so I had to get it. Alright, so, of course, with an N64, you cannot go without Super Mario 64, the OG. You have to get this game. This is the game to get for the system. Torok Rage Wars. Haven't played it yet. Wave Race 64, uh, just like the 1080 snowboarding, I haven't played this on the X64, but I played the GameCube one. But yeah, Wave Race 64. And finally, the two gems of my N64 collection. Mario Kart 64, complete in box. Another game I spent countless hours playing as a kid. Oh my goodness. And the battle mode. I'm so happy they brought back... Oh, excuse me. I'm so glad that they brought back the uh, battle mode for the uh, the Switch version of Mario Kart 8. I can't wait to play that. But yeah, Mario Kart 64. Gotta get this game for the N64 if you don't have it. And the holy grail of my collection, Conker's Bad Fur Day. Very hard to find... Well, very hard to find at a good price nowadays and complete in box. So yeah. Well, that's about it. Let's take a look at my uh, my mess here. But yeah, that is my, <laughs> that's my N64 collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. I will be making more videos in the near future. I'll see you guys later. Take care.